Hi everybody, welcome to a new tutorial on Atom 2. In this video we're going to talk about playback and recording. So I have an instance of Atom 2 here, which I have connected also to an instance of Isom here. Uh, as you can see, the uh, launch um, um, is not active. So in terms of clip, that is off. So let's open uh, Atom 2. And I have a keyboard also from AUM connected to Atom 2. So these are the controls for playback and recording. So let's start. The first one is listen. So at the moment it is not active. That means if you add a note, nothing happens. You just add the note, but you don't, li you don't hear the note. If you activate this, when you add a note, it will send that MIDI message to the in ISIM instance in this case, so you can hear that. Next, you have a launch. If you click on it, you arm the clip for uh, play, which allows you also to uh, therefore uh, play the clip. And if you click on play on the transport control, like so. Of course, if the launch is not active, like so, I deactivate it, and you can see here it's not activated anymore. And you click play on the transport control, it still will not play because the clip has not launched. Um, we'll look in a, f in a future video at the options on how to launch clips. And if you click and hold on the launch button, you have additional options that we'll see in another video. Okay, next we have loop on and you can deactivate that. So for example, you can say the loop is defined like so between there and there. Therefore, when you click play, it will play between uh, these two markers in terms of loop, of course, if you have this on. Now let's get back to the default. Next we have record. So if we click record on that, then um, we just uh, uh, click play. Okay, and start um, to input some notes from the keyboard here. Okay. I have quantize on at the moment. And if you click hold on quantize, you at the moment is set to quantize the notes on. So when they start, also, but you can quantize also the notes off and also the note duration. And... Um, and that depends on the grid setting that you have selected here. The grid settings also help you to um, uh, determine the step in because you can put you can set the input to be a step in. In this case, if you have that activated, if you click on the keyboard note, it will start to add the notes uh, again in uh, and the duration. Um, will be determined by the grid settings that you have here. So, for example, if I change that to uh, quarter notes, like so, and I press another note, you see the duration is different. Uh, another thing to remember is that uh, the quantize is not destructive, so you can also remove the quantization that you set later on, which I will show you that in another video. So, I hope you found these interesting. So we looked at the playback and the recording controls um, in Atom 2. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye.